Welcome to this pick a card reading. So here's how it goes. You have three decks in here and you're going to take a moment and um, I would say pick the one that first comes to your mind. There's always that one that comes first. Don't think about it too much. Pick one and whatever called your attention is the one that's calling you. And we're going to find out what they're telling others about you. What is your love interest telling others about you so let's get started i'm gonna start with deck number one what is your love interest telling other people about you please let us know for people who chose this deck you have to tell us hmm. they're telling people so here we have the seven of swords the ten of cups and the eight of cups They're telling people that um, in a recent uh, past, they had, um, they were a little suspicious about you. They thought that you were basically sneaking around, acting clandestinely like on the shadows. You were too mysterious for them. They were afraid that you were lying and deceiving them. But now, in a current situation, they're having the best of all worlds possible. Like, they are happy. They're super content. They have the ultimate happiness with you or in this relationship or about you. But... They're still a little bit afraid and worried that you, 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 you know, you have this tendency to be a little bit secretive. I don't know if it's you or them, to be honest. It could be just them because they have um, suffered some loss in the past and now make them a little bit paranoid. But they are afraid that you may leave them at any moment. Okay, so that will resonate for some of you, but there is also a possibility here that what they're telling others is that, you know, they are sweet talking you, they are not being honest with you, they're playing you to make you think that they're the best thing since sliced bread, okay? that you think that they're the best thing ever and they plan to just leave. Yeah. So please let me know in the comments if you chose a deck number one, if this resonates with you, if it's the number one or the number two. Sorry about that, you guys. Very, very sorry. So now we're going to be looking at this deck here. Deck number two and see... What is that? People are... What is your love interest telling people about you, okay? Cards are at fall, fell here, so let's look. Okay. It's the sun, and let's grab two more. Two of pentacles and the tower. Oh, my gosh. Hmm. <laughs> All right, they're telling people that someone, I don't know if it's them or you, someone came to a realization, some light came to this relationship and 
someone and 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 brought to light a, a truth came up that someone was cheating and dealing with two people it was an unexpected event it was out of nowhere that happened that this light came up and, and brought the tower moment and so they someone found out that the other party was uh, juggling with two people in a third party situation so that's interpretation number one there's also another one here too which has nothing to do with a third party it just says that um you or them they're telling people that this relationship is just so much work and there was so much going on to be done to be working with and there was like um then ev they had to have a tower moment where a shocking event happened and brought everything down and but um luckily you know um the sun is shining and there will be, have a new beginning okay yeah okay again i would love to know if you can tell me if this resonated with you now let's see the ones that chose deck number three all right spirit what can we tell people about what their love interest is telling other people on this deck the ones that chose this deck four of swords page of cups and three of pentacles oh yeah this is the most romantic i mean i don't know if that's the right word but yeah it's a very uh, nice cute reading here they're telling people that they're waiting and that time is is just a um, they would they would wait their entire life for you or you know that time is just a illusion because they would be waiting forever for you to hear from you to hear a message of love from you so you guys can work things out and plan your future together and start building your life together that's um uh, interpretation number one there's another interpretation also though um not as pleasant but um the other one is that they you know um okay they are or you are someone here in this relationship is no contact decided to go and not talk no communications blocked no contact because they heard a message um of love or a message about a relationship that someone the other party was seeing someone else yeah so this is what i have for you today let me know if you like this kind of video and i'll post some more all right bye guys see you later mm.